This week I have got the Volkswagen Caddy. It's a seven seater peaceful mover in this standout golden green color. Let's find out how good it is as a baby drive. And don't forget to like and subscribe and follow us on our socials. <laughs> the child seat section of this review is brought to you by Infosecure. The sliding doors of the Volkswagen Caddy make it much easier in car parks for you to get kids in and out of the back without worrying about doors opening up and hitting into cars parked next to them. In the back of the Volkswagen Caddy there are Isofix in the two outer second row seats. They're concealed behind beautiful little zips and really nice and easy to access and connect to. Now there are top tether anchorages for all five rear seats which is fantastic and I managed to easily install five infrasecure child seats in here. I've got the Aspire More, the Attain More, the Achieve More and the Accomplish More in here and the versatile folding booster seat. Now the central second row seat has the top tether anchorage on the back of the seat back and for the outer two seats they are in the floor behind the second row seats and in the third row they are on the back of both of those seats. Now it was really nice and easy to install child seats in here and for third row access you can't access that third row with child seats installed in the outer second row seat however you could have one seat without a child seat in and then that easily tumbles forward giving perfect access to the third row or you can actually remove a seat altogether giving you permanent access to the third row. Now legroom throughout the Caddy is really good, it's a really really spacious vehicle. We could easily fit a 180 centimetre passenger in the third row, a rear facing child seat in the second row and a 180 plus centimetre driver in the front. To learn more about the child seats used in this video just click on the link here. Now these enormous windows all around the caddy make visibility really good for passengers and for the driver. However, they can let a little bit too much sun in we found while we had the car. But for just $405 you can have all these rear windows tinted, which I think I would definitely do for my family. Storage in the third row of the Volkswagen Caddy is fantastic. There are cup holders on each side, good for a reusable or disposable coffee cup and a large refillable water bottle fits in them too. There's also another bottle holder that's a bit smaller and another storage space and a great area for iPads as well. Now also on the left hand side of the boot there are hooks for bags too. Now in the second row the storage is great, you've got some fantastic tray tables there that will hold an iPad and a drink will fit in them too and there's USB-C sockets in the back of the central console. And the door bins are a good size in the back, they will hold a water bottle and an iPad fits in them too. There's lots of storage in the front too. There are two cup holders in the central console, they'll hold a reusable and a disposable coffee cup and a large refillable water bottle fits in them too. Behind them is a small central console box and in front of them there's a small storage well and one for your phone too with two USB-C sockets and a 12 volt. The glove box is a good size too that will easily hold my wallet and iPad with the manual. Now the dashboard has a lot of dash storage which is great and above the driver and front passenger there's a really good storage area in the ceiling too. Also by the driver's right knee is a storage drawer and the door bins are a great size in the front. They'll hold a large refillable water bottle and an iPad fits in them too. The Volkswagen Caddy comes with airbags for all three rows of seats which is fantastic news for your precious cargo in the back. Now in this model there are only air vents in the back of the central console box in the second row so third row passengers could get a bit warm however for just $35 you can add ceiling vents to the second and third row which is fantastic. Now this model Volkswagen Caddy that I'm testing has this large tailgate which is a consideration when you park but it's actually free to get barn style doors instead which may be more practical for families. Now Volkswagen have thought of everything here, it's also got this great parcel shelf which will hold up in two positions which is really handy. Let's find out how much we can fit in the boot. When using all seven seats it will fit 10 shopping bags in the boot, 
with a twin pram and three shopping bags, a tandem pram and two shopping bags, a single pram and four shopping bags, or a compact stroller and seven shopping bags. When using five seats, it will hold 22 shopping bags, or a twin pram and 15 shopping bags, a tandem pram and 14 shopping bags, a single pram and 17 shopping bags, or a compact stroller and 19 shopping bags, or a large dog. Now I find the Volkswagen Caddy actually really good fun to drive. It's really nice and light and airy in here and it doesn't have that frumpy feeling that a lot of SUVs have. Now the only things missing here is this is old school, it has a turnkey ignition and it has no adaptive cruise control which I've really missed this week while I've had it. Now you can add both of those and a heap more safety features for $1,825 and I would add those to these but I had it for my family. The media system in the Volkswagen Caddy is pretty simple and easy to use. A couple of things I like is the drag and drop sound option. Also it's got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto which is fantastic. You can also add wireless CarPlay for just $35. Now the climate is also controlled through the screen here and also your vehicle assist systems. Now one that I have found I needed to use a lot is the auto engine cutout to turn that off for each journey because I don't particularly like it. Now when I put it into reverse, the camera image, it is small on this little screen, however it is nice and clear and I found the visibility is so good in the car that you actually, you don't need to rely on that too much. So to sum up with the Volkswagen Caddy, this is serious competition for other seven seat people movers and SUVs, like the Carnival, the Staria, the Palisade and the CX-9. This has got great five seat possibility in the back there. Five child seats fit nicely for large families. Or they can remove a seat in the second row, giving perfect access through to the third row. Or for small families like mine, we can use the second row seats and then remove those seats in the third row and have a great storage space in there for bikes and paddle boards and camping gear and things like that. Also, the drive is really good fun and the media system is good too.